गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन ना हो कम टू द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक ऑफ कन्वर्जन दैट इज ऑक्टल टू हेक्सा रेसिमल कन्वर्जन सो इन द लास्ट नंबर सिस्टम आई थिंक यू हैव लर्न हाउ टू कन्वर्ट वन ऑक्टल नंबर सिस्टम इन टू बाइनरी नंबर सिस्टम सो होप दिस वन नंबर सिस्टम इज क्लियर टू एवरी वन Now come to the next uh, conversion that is octal to hexadecimal. So basically, in this process, first of all you have to convert one octal number into binary number. Okay. Then after that uh, you have to make the grouping of four from the least significant bit. Okay. So making the set of four, uh, making the set of four. This is basically the second step which you have to perform in octal to hexadecimal conversion. then after that you have to check the table of uh, like uh, binary to hexadecimal and after that you will check like uh, the set of four uh, exist for which hexadecimal number so accordingly you just write that hexadecimal number so this will be your uh, octal to hexadecimal conversion so in detail i'll uh, tell you like how to do it uh basically in case of octal to hexadecimal conversion uh, as i am saying you that uh, the step number 1 is to convert the octal number into binary so basically uh, as uh, you have seen in this table uh, many times uh, i think uh, in terms of number system you have seen this table many times i think you have learned this table like uh, if you want to convert any of the octal number into binary i think you have learned this table so uh, basically this step is easy for you people so uh, this is basically your step number 1 that means i can say that whenever you want to convert one octal number into hexadecimal number then it is be, uh, the first process or the first step will be like you have to convert the octal number into binary then after that in this step number 2 you have to convert that binary number into hexadecimal but before that you have to make the group of like four digits in case of the binary number i'll, I'll uh, tell you like how to do it like this is your uh, step number 1 like convert the octal number into binary the any kind of number any kind of octal number which is given to you to solve it first of all you have to convert that number into binary i think this process is very much easy for uh, all of you now come to the next step that is uh, you have to make the groups of four binary digits or you can say the bits now how to make the four binary digits groups so to look up the groups in a table to convert the hexadecimal digit you just check it like whenever you will convert any of the binary number into hexadecimal then there is again one table which you have to learn okay so i am just uh, thinking like you have learned this table if you want to convert any of the octal number into hexadecimal then you have to learn these two tables okay means from 0 up to f you have to learn this table for a binary equivalent okay so these four if four digits in case of binary is zero that means it will be equivalent to zero of the hexadecimal number if uh, you are having a group of four digit that is 0001 then it is equivalent to one so just like that you are having like all the hexadecimal number from zero up to f okay if you have any kind of confusion like how we have done it so you can check our previous video lectures in which i have told you like how to convert hexadecimal number into octal in detail i have told you there okay but uh, you don't have to do anything uh, basically you have to learn this table but uh, if you want to understand it then you just go to the video lecture that is conversion from hexadecimal to octal okay so this is very much easy now come to the next uh, point like with the help of example how you can solve one octal number into hexadecimal i am just taking the example which i have taken in the previous video lecture like uh, whenever we are converting one octal number into binary so you just take it like uh, there is one octal number that is 345 and you have to convert it into hexadecimal so as uh, as i have told you that the step number 1 will be like you have to convert this uh, octal number into hexadecimal uh, first of all in the step number 1 you have to convert this octal number into binary okay so you just take the number that is 345 okay you have taken it even though you have uh, drawn it one table 
then after that you are checking like 5 is equivalent to which number 4 is equivalent to which number and 3 is equivalent to which number okay if you are converting it into binary so 3 is equivalent to 0 1 1 4 is equivalent to 1 0 0 and 5 is equivalent to 1 0 1 so basically whenever you will write your answer then you will write just like this like 0 triple 1 double 0 1 0 1 so this is basically the binary equivalent of this number then uh, to convert uh, like uh, convert the octal number 345 into hexadecimal uh, as i have told you that you have to make the group of four digits so drop any of the leading digit which is uh, at the msb side okay and you just um, pad it or attach it with leading zero to get the group of four binary digits just like that you are having this binary number now which you got uh, for this 345 so you just make the group of uh, like uh, these four digits just like that from the lsb side you will start means from the right most side you will start to make the group of four digits okay so this is one group of um, four digit and this is one another group so you have made the group of four four digits then uh, here come the next step that is you have to convert that binary number into hexadecimal so if you check your table the hexa binary to hexadecimal conversion table then you can check that this four digit group is equivalent to 5 and this four digit group is equivalent to e that means the uh, 345 this is one octal number and the conversion of this number into hexadecimal will be e5 okay hope i think you have understood now you just take one another example that is like the, you are having one uh, another octal number that is 305 okay you have to convert it into hexadecimal so what you will do uh, first of all like you will convert all of these three numbers into binary equivalent like this so these are 5 is equivalent to 100 0, 0, 0 is equivalent to triple zero and 3 is equivalent to 0, 1, 1. Okay, so after that you will group these digits and this is your binary conversion for this octal number but because you have to convert it into hexadecimal that is why what you have to do you have to make the group of four four digits from the lsb side okay from the lsb side and uh, whenever you are making the group of four then uh, this group of uh, four digit is equivalent to five and this group of four digit is equivalent to c that means the final answer is c5 okay I think uh, this is clear so there are some practice questions you just do practice of these questions then after that I am giving you the answers also then you just check your answers like whether it is equivalent to these numbers or uh, these hexadecimal numbers or not okay so if there is any uh, like confusion then in the interactive session I will discuss with you people okay till now uh, i think only one uh, last conversion is left so which i'll tell you in the next uh, video lecture okay so, so thank you everyone thank you so much